Hi friends, Saurav here. Welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to learn about, uh, I mean, uh, we are going to learn about card region. We can create card in Oracle Apex. So uh, we will see how to create card regions and what are the features we have in, in card regions in Oracle Apex. So for that, let me sign into the workspace what we have created. Uh, the workspace name is practice deck. We will create our application in this. Okay, so let me go to practice deck. Let me enter the password here. And here we are. So in this application, in this uh, workspace, we are going to create a new application and uh, there we will uh, see how to create the card region. So I'll click on create. I'll click, I'll create a blank uh, application and then we'll see how to create the card region. I'm going to, I'm going to write this application name as demo and we'll keep everything, uh, I mean blank. We are not going to create anything by default. I'll just click on this create button, create application. So here uh, only one page application will get created. Only home page is there and we have a login page and a global page. So let's run this application and we'll see how this, going to, how this application is going to look like. Okay, so here we have this login page. Let me, let me uh, give my username and password. All right, so here we are. So I'm going to create a new page where we will have uh, a card region. We'll, we'll be creating a card region on that. Okay, so for that, um, I'll click on this uh, edit page one. Here we have, uh, here we have an option as plus. I'll, I'll click on this page and I'll say this, I'll create a blank page. Okay, we have here multiple options. I will show you how you can use these options in later, I mean, other sessions, but yeah, we have multiple options here. For now, we are going to create a blank page. All right, and I'll, I'll uh, give this page name as card region. All right, this is going to be a normal type. Uh, we'll give a breadcrumb to this page. And uh, yeah, no parent, we'll click on next. We'll create a navigation menu. This is going to be card region. We'll click on next and finish. So here we have this another page, page two. We'll, uh, let's run this page and we'll see how this is going to look like. So here we have this card region that the navigation menu got created and this blank page got created, okay? So, <clears throat> Before creating a card region, we'll see what are the tables we have. Okay, so I'll go, in, I'll, I'll go to this object browser and we'll see what are the tables we have. Here we have this EBA projects. Let me go to this table. I will copy this table name. I'll click on this, go to SQL command and we'll see what are the data we have in this table. Okay. I hope you guys will be knowing about that. We can query the table in the SQL uh, commands. If you are not knowing about this, maybe you can comment uh, in the comment box. I will walk you through with more information about this. All right, so here we have these many data. We have status ID, name, description, project lead, budget. So let's say we'll create a, we'll create a, um, a card region with name, description, project lead and budget, okay? So uh, to create a card region, uh, we have a resource. I will uh, take you to that uh, place first. From here, you can get a lot of you know help actually. Okay, so here we have multiple options. I'll go to components. In components, you will see you can create different type of regions with the help of all these components, okay? So today we are going to see how to create card regions. So I'll click on this card region. And you have different type of look, different look and feel of card region. You can explore all these. Or if you want me to explain this, you can comment uh, down below. I'll, I'll show you today one of the 
a region how can you create it so this is a sample a query how you can do this so i'll just copy this thing okay right click copy it and come to this place here in page two we are going to create a um, we are going to create a region to so to create a region click on this content body right click on it and click on this create region so as you can see a new region got created and the region name is new we'll, we'll give this name as uh, project information okay information so here if you go to the type you can see these multiple options all right so we are we will have to select this cards all right so as soon as you'll select the card you will uh, get multiple options under source uh, field all right so you can select the table but for now we are going to write sql query and expand this and paste the query what you have copied now you have these multiple uh, fields what uh, i mean you can uh, change this uh, information so the table name first of all we'll change the table name our table name is eba projects copy this table name paste it here eba projects now here you have different type of columns so what are the primary key we have id is the primary key okay we'll go to this place we'll say id keep this alias name as it is because this is going to play uh, this is going to let uh, uh, front end know that what column is of which type okay so we do not have any secondary uh, key we'll keep it blank now what uh, what the card title will be okay so for that maybe we can give this name as card title copy this name and paste it here keep the alias name as card title now what you want as uh, at the place of card subtitle let's say i'll say budget budget lead is going to be card subtitle so we'll keep it as budget sorry project lead project lead sorry and uh, card body so at the place of card body we'll say description okay so here we'll say description and card secondary body maybe we can give budget we'll copy this and we'll paste it here so this is going to be our uh, alias name of this uh, these columns i'll just align it quickly card primary key card secondary key then card title card subtitle card body and card secondary body yeah so here is the one we are not going to give any of this information we don't know what the icon will be and all this thing will will i will show you how to give these things but for now we'll keep it blank so i'm just going to add blank in front of all these things and we'll just validate it by clicking on this check a uh, button and we'll click on okay and save this and run this and you didn't get anything why all right now we'll see okay okay so here if you will go to attributes you have written the code but you have not declared in the attribute so when you'll go to attribute here you have these options as you can see uh, you have these options all right so come to this primary key first click on it and select the primary key so the card primary key whatever you have selected choose it over here card primary key okay now we'll scroll down title so here you have to choose the title column and card title is that title title column come down again choose subtitle so you'll have to choose this card subtitle card body region you have to choose it from here what column is going to be your card body secondary body again you have to choose it from here and icon badge media all these things will keep we do not have these informations for now so we'll just save it and again we'll run this page and as you can see we have this beautiful card got created so here you can see all the information so one two three four total 12 records are there okay so here this is the name of the card i mean uh, the project and this is uh, what is this 
this is your uh, project lead okay now this is description and this is the budget so this is how you can create a card basically so you can see all the records currently we can see only 12 record it may possible that we have only 12 record in this table quickly we'll do select count star from this table and see here we have only 12 records so that's why you can see only 12 records all right Okay, so along with this, now I will show you how you can uh, change look and feel of this region. Okay, so, okay, one more thing you have, uh, if you're not knowing about these uh, tool, uh, you can get this developer tool in below of the page. Okay, if you if you want to know more about these tools, maybe you can come in below. I will explain you the function of these things. Okay, so uh, for now, I can show you, I can say you that we have this quick edit thing. You, you have to click on this quick edit, hover on any of these components. So this is your breadcrumb, this is your region, hover on at any of the places. And when you'll click on it in the back end, the same uh, region will get highlighted over here. Okay. So now you now you want to change the theme of uh, this region, basically this these cards. So what you can do under attributes, if you'll scroll down, uh, So here you can see this media and adv advanced formatting. So if I will click on this advanced formatting, you have this HTML expression. You can use this to give any HTML expression to this card. For now, we don't want, we do not have any media uh, thing. So we are not going to give this to this card region. Uh, but what we can do is go to the region and come down. Here you have card container. This is a template and in this card container, we have different type of styles, style A, style B, style C and the default. So we already have seen default. Let's see what is there in style A. Select style A, click on OK, save it, run it and you will see somehow it got changed. It got uh, expanded basically. Okay. Uh, so, but class A is somehow similar to default. Now change the style again will will keep it style b okay save run and now you will see somehow this alignment got changed it got uh, it it came in the center these two things card title and subtitle basically again you can change the style and you will you can see this uh, the differentiation in the look and feel of this card yeah so this also got changed Okay, so that's it for today. In the next session, maybe I can, sh I, I will show you some, you know, pictures and uh, uh, these things. Let me go you to card regions. The, so these are different type of regions you can create basically. Okay, so you, you have this beautiful picture and the, if you are showing username and user data, you can show this, uh, you know, this beautiful uh, logo of the, of the user or maybe their picture itself, the blob content and all those things so these are different re representation of the card region so if you want to know more about this card region you can comment below i will explain more okay so that's it for today thanks for watching the tutorial thank you